for a reason because I want to make sure I say this right you guys are going to need to be very very intentional all right with this cycle that you guys are about to go through because you guys are going to be getting a lot of distractions okay look at that so I said that the cards got stiff y'all are going to be getting a lot of distractions I'm here so some of you guys are really going to need to but well, all of you guys are going to need to focus like you're going to have to be very very intentional um during this time when it comes to whatever it is you guys have been working on. Okay, so that's the first message I'm getting. Somebody is going to be wearing a white tank top who is watching. It's like a white spaghetti strap shirt with some black or gray tights. All right, but let's um, clear spirit message for you guys and see how can you guys maximize the energy you guys have and coming. What opportunities are you going to, you guys going to have? Coming in for my Taurus game. Let's see. And this is my message for my Taurus. Most important message at this time. Ooh. Okay, so y'all got two cards came out. Hardship and direction. Okay, so what did I say? I'm already feeling like this hardship. It's not necessarily a hardship. This is just something that's meant to um, distract you guys. All right, so you guys are really going to need to be very, very focused at this time, most certainly. All right, so this is Allure. Please show me the right action right now. Please bring me a sign and a miracle that gives clear direction. May I hear the promptings of my own body. And if for some reason I'm about to head the wrong way, please stop me. Ooh, look at this direction. Okay, and hardship. May I embrace what's happening right now as baffling or painful as it is. Help me, God, to trust where you are guiding me. I am yours. Okay, so this is just so interesting. Look, bottom of the deck, body. Okay, so it's just really interesting to me because these cards look so similar. And this direction, again, says, Lord, please show me the right action right now. Please bring a sign and a miracle that gives clear direction. May I hear the promptings of my own body. And if for some reason I'm about to head the wrong way, please stop me. Okay, so... Clear as day. You guys are definitely um, going to be getting, like I said, I don't feel like it's hardships with this hardships. I just feel like you guys are headed in a direction. And at this point, some of you guys are needing to get back in line. And I was saying this in the last um, two videos and readings I've done for you guys. It was like you guys have kind of gotten off of your path. Some of you guys are really wanting that direction at this time. You're like, you know what? I don't know if I'm headed the right way. Like, give me a sign. Okay, this hardship, I don't feel like it's necessarily hardships. Some of you guys could be going through some hardships, but I more so feel like this is um, an energy of you guys just needing to be sure like what you're doing is the right thing or where you're going is, is the right path for you. All right, that's what I'm getting. Cards don't even want to shuffle, but I'm already seeing the um, Ten of Wands here, bottom of the deck. So a lot of you guys are really moving during this cycle like some of you guys could have recently moved a lot of you guys are thinking about moving some of you guys are really really working hard and just it could feel burdensome right now and maybe that's why you're really wanting to see like wow am i doing the right thing am i going the, di the right direction because i keep getting all of these hardships but yes 
that's actually how you know that you're headed in the right direction. All right, for a lot of you guys, you need to get in tune with your body. For some of you guys, um, you're gonna feel, like you're gonna really, really feel in Taurus. Y'all are naturally a sign that's connected to your senses. So you're feeling, you're touch, you're smelling. All of those things are things that you definitely are naturally in tune with. But this is what Spirit let you know, like your body is gonna let you know, your body is gonna give you guys the signs. Look at this, page of cups. You're going to, you guys are going to be in a period where you're definitely going to know um, that direction. Like, you're going to really feel it, all right? And for some of you guys, you could have someone coming towards you and you guys could feel it. But let's um, see what messages are here for my Taurus here. What messages are most important for my Taurus? So, y'all got the um, page of wands that wanted to come out. A lot of you guys are going to be getting some communication coming in. This could be something that you've been waiting for. This could be something that gets you going for a lot of you guys. Look at this, five of cups. Y'all have moved out of this energy and I feel like this is connected to this hardship. But like I said, I don't feel like this is really a hardship. I feel like this is you getting over the hardships, like finally, fully, 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 fully releasing. And then being clear with this direction, like where you're headed is the right way. Like you're moving on. You just want to know for sure. Like, am I sure that I'm sure? Judgment is on the bottom of the deck. All right, so you guys are releasing. This is you guys, like, finally giving in, surrendering. Like, you know what? I'm ready to fully, fully move forward. Chariot here. Definitely ready to move forward. Some of you guys could be dealing with the cancer. You could just be deciding to either give something another chance or just, you know, you're fully moving past something. You just want to be sure, like, am I going in the, the right direction? Nine of Wands, um, Nine of Swords, I'm sorry. For some of you guys, you are in that nine of wands where you are going to be continuing to move forward. And you like you've been through a lot, but it's like, okay, I'm gonna push forward. For some of you guys, you're just in a period right now where you're overthinking, you're really worried about your direction. So let's see the page of wands here. Like I say, y'all gonna be getting some communication, most certainly. The world, look at this. Yes, going into new cycles. All right, this is that direction. And you guys are definitely gonna be shown that. The Hermit is here. Some of you guys could be dealing with the Virgo. And then we have the Sun. All right, so a lot of you guys could definitely be dealing with the Leo. Things are about to come to the light. You guys, like I said, have been worrying. You're in your mind at this time. I feel like you guys just need some clarity. All right, and it's not even clarity because you've already made the decision. You've already been through the hardships. But this is actually you surrendering and you really fully releasing and giving in. And I feel like y'all have already done that. Y'all are going to get some communication that's for sure, for sure going to like, okay, yeah, confirm. That cycle is over. I'm, I'm moving into another cycle with this world here. A lot of y'all have to go through some things, but you have like learned the lessons and... As a result, with this hermit energy being here, whatever this Five of Cups energy was, it actually pushed you and put you in a place where you needed to be to connect to where Spirit was trying to lead you guys. That's why this direction is here. All right, and when you stumble along the wrong path and you start going in the wrong direction, Spirit steps in and intervenes. Intervenes. <laughs> intervenes. Okay, look at this. Queen of, Queen of Swords is here. So some of you guys could be dealing with the Libra, Aquarius, or Gemini. But I really feel like this is just the energy that you guys are in right now. You've been through a lot. You guys are really, really in your head a lot. You're doing a lot of thinking. You're wanting some clarity. For some of you guys, like I said, you have some communication coming in and you're open to this communication. It could be someone that you cut off, someone that cut you off. Whatever the case may be, I feel like it's some closure um that's needed here for some of you guys and it's going to help confirm the direction but let's see what this five of cups what is this um five of cups here for my taurus i feel like y'all are going to be like relieved for some reason i'm feeling like like this body is here because like your body is literally going to thank you <laughs> and just when i got that look at this gratitude is here like whatever this situation is whatever this hardship is Y'all are going to, going to be like so thankful at the direction or in the direction that spirit actually lined you up with. Look at this five of, five of wands energy. 
and the Wheel of Fortune. A lot of you guys experienced a lot of conflicts. You had a lot of drama. It was just a lot of people involved. There just could have been a lot of confusion. Whatever this is, it was time to release it. And at the same time, this was something that was fated for you guys because you needed to go through this hardship to really, really get yourselves back in line with your direction. You really needed to go through something to really clarify, like, um, I'm hearing your purpose for some reason. Your purpose. It's really important. Some of you guys could be dealing with the Scorpio, um, Leo, or an Aquarius. Look at this. We got the Eight of Cups, the Four of Pentacles, and the Six of Swords. Most certainly. And even though y'all walked away from something, y'all were still holding on to the energy. This person could have even been holding on to you. But this is you guys, Six of Swords. You're moving forward. You finally have gotten into that space where you know it's time to release this. You guys have let it go. You're moving forward. And Page of Pentacles here. As soon as you move forward, as soon as you really, you know, get yourselves in a different space, this person comes in with this communication. And for some of you guys, this communication is going to, like, finally put it into things. Look at this. Page of um, Cups is here. For some of you guys, you could be getting an apology. Could come from a fire sign, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, or even a Pisces. But whatever this is, I feel like this communication is really going to help you guys either in something or it's going to be, like I said, a distraction. So you need to be intentional. You need to stay focused on your direction and what it is you guys want to do or what you are doing. Because y'all done made up y'all minds. Look at this. The chariot came out judgment with all these cards. I'm not going to take all of those. But y'all have made a decision or you're going to be making a final decision with something. Yeah, seven of wands with the ace of wands here. You guys are going to be standing your ground. Someone definitely wants to come in and either start new with you guys with this ten of cups here. Or I feel like for you guys, this is just you standing your ground. Like you've already been through the burdens. You've been through um, the period where you were defending something. But like you're no longer defending it. And with this Ace of Wands here, Spirit comes in and was like, you know what? Since you have learned the lesson, you have finally released it. I'm going to place you back on your direction. And I'm going to bless you with this new start. For some of you guys, this new start could be starting with this person. Someone definitely has a lot of passion for you. And they do want to go into a new cycle with you. Look at this. Six of um, Pentacles. Could be done with the Libra. Someone wants to go into a new cycle with you most certainly. And I feel like this time around, this person, they want to give, like, whatever they weren't, weren't given. Look at this. Ace of Pentacles. <laughs> Definitely. Y'all got to a lot of newness coming in. And maybe that's what this, this nine of swords energy is here for. Because it's on both decks. Okay? It's like it's time for you to move forward. You have some new opportunities. You have something new that's starting in your life. But someone wants to come back and go into another cycle with you. Wow. Okay, I see Pisces, Sagittarius, as well as a Virgo. With the moon here and this Ace of Cups, some of y'all don't even see this coming. Okay, this person wants to come in. They want to heal the situation. I feel like if this was someone who used to hold back their emotions, they would always leave you in the dark. You could have felt like the whole thing was just an illusion. They could have acted like it wasn't as serious as it, it was. This person wants to come back and, like offer their love but i feel like you guys have already been in this hermit energy or you're going into this hermit energy and it's like your confidence has grown now you're not the same person that you used to be okay for some of you guys you're really really you've become more spiritual this is really really like led you guys to become more spiritual go into the queen of wands yeah nine of swords is in reverse when you guys really sit and reflect and think about all the work you had to do to get yourselves to this queen of wands energy Nine of Swords came out in reverse. You're not going to have to overthink it anymore. It's going to be clear as day. Okay, that's why the sun is here. It's going to be clear as day. For some of you guys, someone is really, really trying to come back and open themselves up to you. But at the same time, this person... I feel like this person just does not know how because they know that you're going to be defensive. I'm not getting that one off the ground yet. Six of Cups in reverse. Y'all don't want to reconcile. Someone wants to come back and reconcile. And y'all do not want to reconcile because I feel like your life is moving in a whole different direction now. Go into the sun. 
yes what did i say okay six of wands with the sun here y'all are moving forward into victory success like you're finally back happy and look at this person over here they're conflicted now because they like dang they came back around they know you experienced some hardships the direction changed you guys could have split you guys could have had something happen that was unexpected but now that they're coming back and they want to make all these offers to you they're like confused as to why you're not going to be open to it and for you guys it's just because you this situation like you found your happiness is what i'm getting a lot of you guys are really showing gratitude or needing to express gratitude to the situation because it definitely helped you. Look at this solitude and look at behind this self-love. A lot of you guys had like this taught you a lot about self-love and even about solitude, having to stand by yourself, having to build something by yourself. It was something because this hardship, it leveled you up to say the least. And now this person is conflicted because they like, dang, they want to come back and make an offer to you. And they just know that you're not open to it. Give me one more card spirit for this six of cups in reverse. Yeah, the sun. It could definitely be a Leo. A lot of you guys are definitely dealing with the Leo. You could have blocked communication with this person. Um, for some of you guys, you didn't expect for this person to come back. Or a Leo could just be significant to this situation. But whatever the case may be, I feel like you guys are standing your ground. And as a result, you have a lot of new opportunities that are going to be flowing in for some of you guys it's like you you already are starting to get these opportunities look at this the stars here some of you guys could be dealing with an aquarius or you could have aquarius or leo heavy in your chart for a lot of you guys it's like your wishes are coming true and for some of you guys you don't even see this coming yep okay three cups is behind that you don't even see this coming so I, I love this. Like I said, stay focused, be intentional. Don't let nobody come back around and distract you. You've done a lot of work. When you really think about the situation and you sit down and reflect, you're not even going to have to really think about it. That's what I'm going to do, you guys. All right, so let's get some angels of abundant spirit messages for you guys. And let's see what abundance is coming into you guys at this time or what can you do like i said to maximize your abundance Ooh, first of all i have an abundance mindset okay so this is you guys you're thinking big all right windfall of abundance i love this taurus this is so bomb an increase in abundance is arriving in many different forms some of them unexpected be open to receive it and know that this abundance comes to you to support your life purpose, your health, and charitable work. What did I say? Y'all are moving forward. This is victory, success, happiness, joy, being optimistic, being open, getting recognition. And as for your needs to be met, God and the angels can come to your aid only if you make a free will choice to be helped. And it begins with asking. It doesn't matter how you ask God for help, but only that you do so. The same holds true with clearly asking other people to assist you. And I feel like that's what this um, direction and hardship is here for. Because a lot of you guys, you just need to have that confirmation that you're on the right path. For some of you guys, this is your confirmation. For others of you, if you feel like you swayed off the path or you're just confused when you're brought into all the hardships that you're getting, you just need to pray. Or, you know, just ask for your needs to be met in whatever way. This could be in your relationships. This could be you, you know, really sitting down meditating. You have a windfall of abundance that's coming for you, okay? You just need to stay in this abundance mindset. For some of you guys, detox your friendships. Some of you guys could be around people, have some people around you that's blocking your abundance or causing this, this abundance to be withheld. All right, but that's what I got for you guys. Um, a lot of healing. A lot of abundance coming in like i said a lot of it is going to be unexpected so you guys still be open but that's what i got for you taurus if you found messages that resonated do like share comment and subscribe bye guys